if you don't know Ayo Mogaji, she's one of the uh, the veteran actress put in Yoruba and English movies and she recently came out or she made a post rather consigning ladies getting uh, giving birth or give, uh, getting pregnant at 35 that is if they don't find somebody to marry before or at 35 that they should get pregnant for a man maybe they come across the love or also in agreement to have a child with them and according to her she said once a lady turns 35 there's no need for you to start waiting for you um for marriage again the best thing is just for you to get a, a pregnant with somebody that you love or is in agreement with you so this got me thinking which i will try and put what the post on it on what she said so this got me thinking and i although i saw a lot of comments of people agreeing or so disagreeing so does that mean that is right to do that or i'm not condemning single mother or single parenting but you intentionally doing it it's what i don't think i agree with because although some people becoming single mothers is not by choice or not that they they wanted to do it but because of due to circumstances maybe by rape or the person they got pregnant for denied or didn't accept the pregnancy and all of that but because i know that there is no woman that just want to be a single mother or just want to give birth to a child without the father being present but she's trying to encourage it she said even if the man does not want to take responsibility no problem just tell the man that okay don't worry let me give birth to a child and i will foot the bills i will take care of i will do everything but just accept to give to to make me pregnant and i'll take full responsibility <laughs> what is this world turning into so ma <laughs> so are you trying to say that people should just a woman uh, 35 she just once she's 35 and no 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 traces of marriage coming she should just look for a random or whoever that is she's dating she just get pregnant for the person and move on what if later she still she gets pregnant or she you know she gets married what are you not going to do so then now maybe after giving birth to that child and she gets married then she the the father or the new husband start having issues and all that how do we, how do it do that so <laughs> this is just kind of complicated but i honestly i don't agree with this she saying so does that mean that a lady that is 35 is because she she, she she hasn't gotten married at that age is over for her or she cannot still get married and give birth to ch children there are still some people that still got married very early and they did not still give birth they did not get pregnant early it was even their late thirties, late 40s they eventually got married and there's there are some people too that they got married late and immediately they still got pregnant and you know they, they are mothers of children so life you can't predict you can't predict life okay what if at that 35 the lady now tries to get pregnant and she she can't or she she couldn't or she can't get pregnant what will she do so <laughs> i don't agree with what she said you can't predict life everybody have or has their own time Things can happen anytime for anybody. Some people get married early and they don't give birth early. Some people get married late and they start giving birth. In fact, as many as they want, they still give birth. There are some too that so everything is like it's just vice versa. So you can't predict life. Are we trying to promote a, a, or lower our moral standard in the world? Because I don't just understand what is going on that doesn't mean we should we should not do things the right way people are still getting married every day so <laughs> these are our uh, own i believe <laughs> i don't believe in it or i don't 
totally agree or I don't agree with it. But it all depends on our choice, on our individual, on your decision. But I just feel it's not the right thing. This is, we are not promoting, you know, we are, our, our moral values are declining. What are we trying to tell the new generation or next generation of women or youth or adults? So they should just, what if now you just go and the person now now decided you get you get pregnant and the person decided to reject the pregnancy or tell you I don't want or why should you go and get pregnant? The woman starts taking responsibility on her own. Then later you start complaining that oh uh I you I have a deadbeat father or this 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 when you intentionally I'm not saying that there's people there are single mothers which it's not they did not plan for it. But you doing it intentionally is what I will not agree because now from what she's saying is like she's trying to tell you to do it intentionally, like just get pregnant. Not that is by you didn't plan for it. You know, there are some maybe pregnancy or you are dating someone before you know it, you are pregnant. You did not plan for it. It was not intentional. I understand. Uh -huh. But not this one that you are intentionally doing it to because I, a woman cannot find a husband at so 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 age. So I, I beg any man or any my relationship, let me just get pregnant. Uh -huh. I don't still support. I know the world, things are somehow and all of that, but that doesn't mean we should accept what is wrong. What is wrong is wrong and what is right is right. We will not change that. So that's it for this video. Do you agree with what she said? Let me know in the comment section. Can you do this? Let me know in the comment section. So thank you for watching. See you in my next one. Bye.